Folks, in an earlier uh, video I made, I pointed out that there uh, were some grants. You'll find it if you look around. Uh, to be allocated state by state to the Chinese. Well, I'm going to read this to you right from the source. This ought to really wake you up if you're not awake already. Uh, never before has so much controversy swirled around uh, a president, including proof of citizenship, and, and just so much crap, all right? But so here it is. It's from, I don't know if you can see this. Let me, let me try this setting here. Examiner.com, Boise, Idaho, okay? Let's try to get in here. Idaho to be the first Chinese state. Governor Butch Otter in league with notorious Marxist Barack Hussein Obama have hatched a plan to make Idaho the first Chinese-owned state in America. You heard me right. The first Chinese-owned state in America. This should raise all kinds of red flags. Okay, come on, man. Otter and company have named this project 60. Sounds innocent enough. Till you realize that Otter and his minions are afraid to call it what it is. Excuse me, globalization of America and surrender of sovereignty. Now, if this doesn't fall under treason or tyranny, I mean, I really don't know what is. If it were called that, someone may want to ch charge order with sedition. Under Barack Hussein Obama, it has become increasingly difficult to do business in America unless you are from a foreign nation. Idaho, under the stewardship stewardship of Governor Butch Otter, has opened the door for a Chinese invasion, wherein the sovereignty of Idaho and America will be sodomized by all parties involved. Project 60 takes advantage of a federal program that grants permanent residency to foreign nationals, in this case, Chinese. This program comes with special tax exemptions to the foreign firms moving here. Well, isn't that lovely? They tax us so they break our backs, but they're going to let them have a state and tax-free. Isn't this just freaking lovely? American companies do not get the tax exemptions. So much for the Constitution and equal protection. Idaho is struggling financially and is widely known and equal protection. Idaho is struggling financially and is widely known that America is broke. So why tax breaks for the Chinese? Chinese want to limit its exposure to America's debt. China needs to maintain its trade deficit trade deficits. I'm gonna put a link to this so you can read the rest of it. But look, man. This is beyond insane. They are going to give, look it says right here, China has bought 50 square miles south of Boise, 30,000 acres of Idaho gone to foreign nationals. Governor Otter says this will help reinvigorate our American industrial base. Just how this will do it, since the plants will be staffed with foreign nationals, is a question that remains unanswered. Now, people, if this isn't a wake-up call or a call to arms or whatever the hell, we're done, okay? This is enough. I've uncovered enough information lately that it's just thoroughly rattled my cage where it's legal to use us as guinea pigs, where it's legal to uh, poison us, uh, our water, our food, uh, with the chemtrails, etc., etc., I just haven't had the um, 
to get up and go to put it up on YouTube, man, because it irks me to death, all right, that America has come to this. This is beyond pitiful, and we best get our heads out of our rear ends and do something about it, and fast, okay? Okay? You understand me? I'm done with this one for now. Check it out yourself. Examiner.com, all right? Check it out. Later.